Hi guys, you're welcome to the bird's eye view. If you're new to this channel, please like, share, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can stay up to date with the videos as they drop. Subscription is absolutely free. Hi everyone, you're welcome to the bird's eye view. And in the news today, a man in Akron, Ohio State was shot at least 60 times by the police after they said fire shots from his vehicle and fled on foot. The American police force at it again. Until a few hours ago, this man was on named unidentified but he has been identified to be a 25 year old named Jaylan walker protesters scenes shut down a crown after this man was shot and murdered and he, sh he is said to be shot 60 times such a gruesome way to murder a young man uh, a number of people gathered late Thursday morning to protest outside the Akron Police Department calling for justice for the 25-year-old. This protest comes just a few days after Walker was shot and killed by police early Monday amid an overnight chase. So from this news, it shows that he wasn't just killed immediately, he was chased from uh, the previous day, late hours, the previous day into early hours of Monday. The Akron police says they attempted to stop Walker's car just after midnight Monday for a traffic infraction and equipment issue. Walker instead led the officers on a high-speed chase down East Talmadge Avenue towards State Route 8. <laughs> Police said he fired shots from his vehicle, then fled on foot. Which means, like most Americans, Mr. Walker was armed for self protection or nobody knows. Police says they fired, they first deployed their tasers, but ultimately opened fire after he said Walker made motions that caused them to fear bodily harm so which means they didn't fire shots because he actually fired shots from his vehicle it was the motion of his vehicle that made him fire shot at him if the motion of the vehicle is scary and dramatic and you're scared of it why not just get out the way getting you into your vehicle and continue the chase they had to open fire and now it has cost the young man his life Eight officers unleashed a all of gunfire that was captured by their body cameras. One by these officers, obviously, a firearm was found ditched in his vehicle after the incident. In other words, he might have shot the weapon, but he didn't take it out of his vehicle. He left it in the vehicle and he continued on foot. So I don't know how this qualifies to be a high speed and gunfire situation but you know it's going to be the uh the footage of their body cam against their own words in court because obviously this case is going to go to court this is going to be like another life taken from the black community and they obviously won't take it lightly individuals have gone on to social media to share their opinions and the satisfaction and displeasure as far as this news is concerned bishop talbot swan posted this his name is jayland walker eight akron ohio cops fired 90 bullets at him it's in him 60 times throughout his entire body a whole number of 90 bullets 60 bullets got to this young man imagine shooting a young man 60 times this is cold-blooded murder and this officer should be charged 
The cops pulled him over for a traffic violation. He was 25. He was a DoorDash driver. He was unharmed. He was murdered. Hashtag Jaylan Walker. Well, we are sticking around for matters arising as far as this particular story is concerned. We have our shovels ready to dig out the information as they surface. So please like, share, comment, whatever you want us to research on, subscribe and click the notification bell. Subscription is absolutely free so you can stay up to date with our videos as they drop. Until the next news, thank you and thank you for staying with us.